Oh, Michael, I just wanted to do a quick walkthrough of your cabin kit. Right now, uh, for YouTube purposes, I left your last name off and your exact address. The building is going to go to this city, and I, since we do not have a physical address, I just put in 124 Main Street. Okay, so go to end wall A. And you can see this building is 20 wide and has three bays on the end wall. The side walls will have five bays. So we'll walk through each one of these openings. Right now we have a three wide by four tall opening and it's two eight off of the slab. And it's in the center of the bay. We have a standard size door opening, 3068 on the slab and it's in the center of the bay. And we have a window above it that's three by two and it's eight off of the slab. This window is 3040 and it's in the center of the bay and it's two eight off the slab. So we'll go to end wall B. There's nothing on end wall B right now because in previous cabins like this, customers have put their windows for their two rear uh, bedrooms on the side. So there's nothing on end wall B. And we can add some openings there if you like. Let's go to side wall A. So you have a 10 foot covered porch area. This opening is five wide by three tall and it's three eight off of the slab and it's in the center of the bay. This window back here, window opening back here is 4040. 28 off the slab in the center of the bay. So let's go to sidewall B. Okay. You have another opening in the rear, 4040, in the center of the bay, 28 off of the slab. We have a door here on the side. Some customers choose to remove that door and some use it as an entrance as well. So this is a 3068 it's in the center of the bay and it sits on the slab. Here's an opening here. That is 5 by 5040. It's in the center of the bay and it's 28 off of the slab. So let's take a look at the framing. And there's the framing of the building. Okay, so let's go to the engineering tab real quick. 2021 IBC, 105 wind speed, 20 on the roof load, and two feet for your frost step. And you have a single eight inch frame for the building and it's designed to the barn dominium code. So now we go to the sheeting tab. PBR panel 26 gauge for the roof. Classic rib is 26 gauge as well. We use PBR panel on the roof and classic rib on the side. Um, they look almost identical, but the seams uh, will be offset a little bit so you don't have to match up the seams from the roof to the sidewall. Just makes the install a lot easier. Now the roof sheeting, we have, um, it's white for now but we have all these color options here and same for the sidewalls black now but we can change it to any of these that you prefer and then we have all the trim set at white but as you can see here there's a lot of options on the trim as well and um, that should be it